Volleyball lost. Volleyball lost! I gotta get close to the clock. Volleyball lost. Say it ain't so. They lost. If you ever see a colt fighting in the forest with a grizzly bear, help the colt. The colt gon' need it. Close the clock. On Monday, our girls golf team hit the course once again, remaining undefeated. Soccer also took on Jack Britt. Uh, Jack the Brit. Hijack the shirt. Uh, I think I just said it. Ship. Hi Hijack Jack the Brit. There we yeah, go. Last year's hometown motto. I came up with it. I came up with it. Uh, they won 3 0. And then our tennis team, remember what I said last week? They, they played. What do you expect? They, they took another W. Always. On Tuesday, our boys' soccer team took on Asheboro, taking the loss 5-1. It was probably man. a tough team, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it has to be. Never heard of them, but yeah. The very same day, our volleyball team traveled to Grace Creek. <laughs> you know, they didn't take the dub. Rival school. Uh, they lost 3-1. You know, shout out my girlfriend. She went crazy. Anyway, right, crazy. anyway that's not the point. Um, both teams came into that game 11-0. And uh, one team left 12 -0. And one team left 11-1. It's all right. You know, KJ, we're going to pick it back up. And all we right. play them again. Uh, October, I believe October 12th. My girlfriend went a great streak, but I'm still a cold at heart. Right. At heart. I'm a cold now. Well, I was like, your neck. Yeah. Um, but uh, I believe October 12th, so that game, we need to bounce back. We really need to bounce back. Go Colts. So we'll see what happens. On Wednesday, soccer took on Southview. At K Fears uh, on the on the ranch. On the ranch. <laughs> on the ranch. Somebody give me some salad. But it took a, took them on on the ranch, winning 3-0. It is your own. It was a pretty good game. Um, I announced it was, it was a pretty good game. I was able to watch it all. I loved it. Um, tennis. They played again. Um, and what else? What else? What else? Is else you? Now, what else? You? Um, it's, at this point, it's ridiculous how good our tennis team is. I, in my entire high school career, I don't believe they've ever lost a game, dropped a set, uh, gave a high five to the opposing team, nothing. Um, so they're doing a great job, and we are looking forward to seeing what they, what they have in the store. Yeah. Also, today, Thursday, our varsity football game got moved to today. I they were filming this away at Peace Sweat. The JV football game got moved to Monday next week at home. The we are support your Cubs. You're young Cubs. You're young Cubs. You're young Cubs. Part of all, since the game today against Lumberton, you know, hopefully we can, we're gonna win the game. Then we just play Lumberton. I believe we just played Lumberton. Yeah, we play the game. We're gonna win the game. Yes, that Lumberton game was absolutely outstanding. It was crazy. Uh, at one set, I believe it was going into the third. We were down 24-19. Ended up rallying back and winning that uh, set 27 to 25. This time it's gonna be a blowout. So don't even worry. About yeah, we're not worried about Lumberton. We're not worried. About and that does it for this week's episode of Call the Clock. We appreciate you watching. Share it with your grandma. Share it with your mom. Put it on Facebook. Put it on MySpace. Put it on MySpace, okay? And make sure to tune in next week, Friday morning, uh, to watch the best sports show in the land. Can I get a hello? Goodbye. And okay. And I'm down. <laughs>